Well, hair salons and barbershops across the county are still trying to bounce back after all the shutdowns. Allie Wagner's live at Del Mar's barbershop, or Del Mar, Dell's barbershop in Escondido with details on how they're going mm -hmm. and how things are going for them. Hey, Allie. Hi, you guys. Yes, and in fact, uh, hey, it's a busy morning here at Dell's Barbershop, and, and I guess we're really lucky because I've got Dan and I've got Jason who are both here this morning. Dan, Dan I'm going to start with you. Good morning. Good morning. So tell me a little bit about the history of this barbershop, first of all. Well, we showed up in, uh, in the middle 50s, and my dad opened the shop in 1959, and uh, this is our third location, but we've been here 40 years. I'm retired. Jason, my son, he runs the shop. He bought me out and threw me out. So that's just how it goes. But actually, uh, we're really proud of Escondido. When we showed up, there was about 6,000 people here. And uh, now it's a huge city. They got art centers. They've got uh, the downtown is, is really quaint now. And it, it's really a cool place. And yeah. Plus, the, uh, the mayor's doing a good job. <laughs> well, and so, Jason, I'm going to come over to you real quick. Don't mind me. Let me uh, no, interrupt no as you're working. <laughs> so tell me, I mean, things have been a little bit crazy over the past year. Now you guys are back open, being able to do what you need to do. We're, I mean, what has it been like? Um, it's been really tough. I mean, obviously, like everybody, uh, you know, we're super happy to be back open. Thank God they finally lifted the restrictions and we got the numbers back down to where it's a workable number. But, uh, you know, we're just like everybody else, doing everything you can do to be as safe as possible, take care of our clients. They're number one. And uh, and just try to move forward and uh, try to recoup, you know, where try to get back to where we were, which is, you know, like everybody, just trying to do our best. <laughs> yeah, and I would imagine. I mean, when you have been in town for so long, I yeah. mean, there is that pressure to kind of keep things going, right? Yeah, and just kind of getting everybody wants to get back to the normalcy, and 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 you know, we're all making our changes and, and doing what we need to do uh, again to be safe and whatnot, but. Uh, you know, I think it's actually now we're moving forward, and uh, I'm excited. I'm excited about the projection of where we're going to get to, and uh, and uh, as a, as a whole. Yeah. And uh, so, just super happy to be here. Yeah, <laughs> to be I would imagine you get to drink a little <laughs> yes. sigh of relief. I would imagine it was scary. Nothing, nothing worse than sitting at home and and staring at the wall. Yeah. <laughs> you know. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely much better. And of course, uh, they open at 8 a.m. Um, on Tuesday through Sunday, right? Saturday. Saturday. Tuesday, Tuesday Saturday. through Saturday. So um, just a cool spot up here in Escondido, you guys. And very happy to be back open, giving haircuts. Uh, so we'll send things back over to you. I bet. Very cool to see them 